Hello and welcome to Surprise Toy Box. Uh, here is the latest Lego brick head to build. I ordered this um, a couple months ago, I think, when there was a sale. I don't remember what it was for, but I needed um, to uh, add some more things to like reach the gift with purchase threshold. So I did want this. I think this is $24.99 in Canada, and I'm a big Lord of the Rings fan, so I couldn't resist. And I really like Aragorn and Arwen. Um, People were really happy when the Lord of the Rings theme came back. I had, I think, the majority of sets um, from a lot I bought, and then I built them all, and then I sold it. So I am saving up for the Rivendell set, but that one is really expensive, so we'll just have to set up for this for now. Um, so 261 pieces. Um, here is the top, and it says actual size. This is the crown piece, I think? Yes, that Arwen has. And on the side it says Lord of the Rings, and here are the other ones. So, um, I wasn't gonna get the Frodo and Gollum just cause like, they look so ugly. Like, he looks like he's bald and then Gollum's like creepy and ugly looking. Um, this one looks cool though, the Balrog and, and Gandalf, I might get that in the future. Um, but I feel like if I have two of, of the three, I might as well just get this one. This one is, um, $19.99 versus $24.99 for the other one, so I don't know why it's priced less, maybe because Gollum's like a tiny thing. But, um, yeah, let's open it up. Let's see. Let's just slice it open on, I guess, this side. And... Oh, oh. There we go. Let's pour everything out. Ooh. Okay, so ooh, we have one book with Aragorn, one book with Arwen, and then we have bag one, bag two, another bag two, another mini bag one, and what's this one? This is a big bag too. Um, so I guess bag one is Arwen. You can tell by the green in the dress. So let's open it up. I'll just uh, pour out the contents here. So you can take a look. Let's dump that out. And I'll open up the smaller bag one. Over here. Alright, let's get started with building. And there we have Arwen with four extra one by one pieces, including an eye. Let's open up bag two and we'll get building on Aragorn. There's two mini bags. Okay, so let's grab 
the other booklet. Oh, here's the finished Arvin in the book. And then we're gonna grab the Aragorn one and start building. And there is Aragorn. Here is the picture in the instruction booklet. We have a bit more loose pieces. Uh, there's two, four, six, eight, nine single tile type pieces as extra. So let's take a look at the couple. Uh, so Arwen's dress is kind of plain. Um, it's just a, kind of a light lime green. The, the hair pieces were kind of difficult. Oh, you know what? I think I made her hair come for too much. Let's see. The instructions are a little bit hard to follow just because there's so many like different pieces for the hair and stuff. Um, I'll just leave this for now, but I think it goes back a little, like one slot more. Um, just because if you compare it to this, it looks like it doesn't like hang out. Um, so her hair kind of like looks a little bit weird right now, um, but I'll fix that. Um, yeah, so she looks like she has a giant forehead um, just because of the crown, and I think that's uh, all brick heads that are like a person. Um, so there's the back, her hair, and then she has the silver crown, or like. Oh, this is also totally upside down. No wonder she looks so weird. Hold on, let me fix this. Okay, so that looks a little bit better. Um, I s switched this around, um, so I think it does hang out just a little bit. So uh, her elf ears are like that. Um, I don't know if I built everything correctly, like facing the right way, maybe. Um, but yeah, so I don't recall her ever wearing a light green dress like this in the movies, but I don't know. And here's Aragorn in his like kind of King of Gondor outfit. And his crown. Um, he has a beard, which is an interesting <laughs> kind of design here. Uh, here's his crown, and it's like a silver circlet around his head. There's like his hair detailing. Hopefully, got it all right. His cape. Sometimes I don't know if I'm supposed to shift this up or down a little bit. And he holds a sword. This is like a new um, mold, I think. I don't recall ever seeing this sword before at least in this size and yeah there's his armor uh, like chest piece got that right so yeah another two brick heads to add to my collection pretty cute um, anyways um, until next time like comment subscribe and I'll see you guys next time bye